serve a lot of brides here at Chick-fil-A. We serve them in the AM, we serve them in the PM. It'd be great if we had a system in place where we would know the quality of the fries at all times. It'd be, it would be great to have that. Hi, I'm Jay Duff, and we're at the Chick-fil-A Technology Innovation Center. This semester, we explored computer vision as a means of tracking waffle fry freshness. This was a project that spanned two semesters, and you're going to hear from Abby and Mateo as they tell you how they trained a vision model, and then you'll hear from Joey how he combined these algorithms to track the waffle fries as they pass through product chains. Mateo and I worked on a machine learning project here at the Rev Center. We developed a computer vision model to track waffle fries as they move through the fry chute with the goal of alerting team members when fries have been there too long. This will ensure that we never give customers soggy fries. In addition to tracking fry freshness, the main goal of this project was simply just to explore the different machine learning technologies out there and how they could be applied to different aspects of Chick-fil-A's business. Well, I took over the Smart Shoot project this summer. Um, it's been a lot of fun. I got to learn a lot about computer vision and how the entire process of computer vision works. What I really liked about this experience was getting to see all the different parts of a computer vision model and really getting a hands-on experience with data sets and computer vision frameworks. So I took the detection model and combined it with tracking software to track waffle fries going through the production chute. So here we visually indicate how long each container has been in the chute and put a red box around it when it's been over two minutes. I really enjoyed this experience so much that I'm coming back next semester and I'm really looking forward to bringing this to the next level of putting it on a high performance portable computer. Our innovation center follows a trimester calendar. Most of our students are computer science majors. However, we're also interested in mechanical engineers, electrical engineers, we have a chemical engineer coming, and we have some industrial engineers. This semester, we also had an animator from SCAD. So if you're a local student to Atlanta and you're interested, please go to this website listed below and submit your application.